can't do it, maybe. Bob Iger, man, he, he knows how to survive, right? Uh, um, unbelievable, right? It, it, like, how they survived this vote is beyond me. I mean, could they have cheated? Probably. Disney CEO Bob Iger pushes back against his claims infusing messaging as a sort of a number one priority in our films is not what we're up to. Well, how do you understand? Okay, let's have a look. Really? Disney Movies 2017. Okay, Coco, yes. Oh, look. Brown people can be people too. Beauty and the Beast. Uh, no, they're just giving another job to uh, whatever her name was. Oh, gosh. She, she, calling her beauty. The Last Jedi. Oh, yes. The destruction of culture. Yes, I remember that. Right? Yeah, yeah. The absolute destruction of culture. Of male uh, heterosexual culture. Cars, I don't know anything weird or faggy they did with that part. Okay, they'll still Thor Ragnarok, a, a, a big deconstruction for uh, um, the character. So, fine, 2018, not so bad. Seven years ago, uh, it's creeping in, right? Creeping in. So, Ralph breaks the internet. I think that was fine. Incredibles 2, I think that was fine. Mary Poppins, a little bit fair. Black Panther, I thought it was excellent. I, I, um, Crystal Robin, Avengers. Okay, I, the only thing I see here is Deep Incompetence, which was the uh, solo. So, 20, again, it hasn't really hit yet. The Trump years hasn't really come in yet. Oh, wait, well, did I, did I miss Ant-Man versus Wasp? Yeah. And they must have had Captain Marvel at some point. What was Captain Marvel? Because if a Black Panther and Avengers, oh no, yeah, Infinity War. So that's the first one. Uh, Ant Man and Wasp, yeah, that that again, you had woke creeping in there. So 2019, Aladdin, Dumbo. Do you remember how good times were? Fuck me. Uh, Toy Story. Did they do anything funky with that? I can't remember. We had Captain Marvel. Uh, uh, Last year, I would meh. Uh, Rise of Skywalker, just unwatchable garbage. Avengers Endgame, meh. Dark Phoenix, more incompetence. Glass, they're really pushing this on uh, Netflix right now. I really got to check it out. Spies in the Art of Rain. Nothing really is jumping out at me as being super woke. Okay, listen, he's making a decent point right now. Mulan woke, right? Soul woke. Star Girl, don't you remember it? Uh, Timmy. Timmy Failure makes this. I have no idea. That looked a kid movie. Onward. Uh, I probably won't. New Mutants, that was delayed for like two years. Uh, Call of the Wild One, I have no idea. Underwater, Night House. Okay, none of these things are real movies. Stop. <laughs> Clouds. Okay. Uh, Jungle Cruise, not well because they're called Cruella. Um, I don't know. Black Widow. Agonizingly super woke. Okay, so yeah, uh, here we go. So uh Black Widow woke shit, Luca woke shit, Rava uh and the last one woke shit, Eternals, super woke shit, uh uh Enta Entando woke shit, Free Guy was okay, San Chi woke shit, West Side Story woke shit. Uh last year I didn't see French Dispatch. No, but okay, it's not really a Disney movie, they just find it. It's like uh uh, uh, eyes of Tammy Baker probably woke shit. Tammy Faye probably woke shit. Yeah. So okay. Again, messaging infused. Uh, Black Widow, Luca, uh, uh, Eternals. Uh, what's this? En Encanto. Uh, uh, West Side Story. Uh, the Shang Chi. Yeah. All of these are are replete with agenda. So yes. Buzz Lightyear sucks a cock. Strange World, uh, uh, Agenda, Multiverse of Madness, Agenda, right? America, Turning Red, Super Agenda, Wakanda Forever, Agenda, uh, uh, Better Nate than Lev, I have no idea, Hollywood, Stargirl, oh, no. uh, uh, Thor, Agenda, Avatar, Avenger, uh, 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 Agenda, not Avenger, Definitely, like, did it Bob Burgers movie? Really, who gives a shit? Uh, um, Again, okay, none of these are under like real movie movies, right? These are things they finance, but yeah, look, completely agenda driven. 
I mean, it, I mean, lit, just completely agenda driven. I mean, I did, how on earth can like, 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 so much of output is low quality agenda driven shit, right? Little murmur. I, yeah, agenda. Right, she's black. Haunted Mansion. I didn't see it, but yeah, black people. Right, because black people didn't have any of our. Because you know, you got to say sorry to the black people. Elemental agenda. Wish agenda. Indian you know, super. Agenda. The Marvels. How much more agenda can you fucking get than that? Right? Are you out of your mind? That's that's crazy. Right? Right? That is that absolutely insane. Uh, and quantum mania. Yeah, agenda. So I okay. So Bob, what's your point, darling? Let's. Let, let, I, I want to hear what you have to say, honey. Okay. So, if using messaging is a, is a sort of number one priority in the films and TV shows, is not what we're up to. Well, how come that's what you did then in all those films and TV shows? Is it just a coinky dinks? Could it be? Maybe. Uh, I don't think so. In what feels like a, te uh, uh, a textbook case of gaslighting, Disney CEO Bob Iger has claimed that contrary to popular criticism, the entertainment conglomerate does not consider the inclusion of social the political messaging in their project to be a number one priority. I mean, I look, maybe that, hey, maybe not a number one priority, right? But a, a high priority, right? I, uh, it's... Um, it, okay, maybe not number one, but it's still there. <laughs> okay, I mean, I mean, okay, it's just the number two priority. Number one priority is uh, uh, making the movie, right? Uh, uh, the minutes it fills up on our streaming service. Uh, um, it's just, it's, it's so stupid, it's beyond belief. Uh, it really is. It really is so dumb. Uh, uh, da, da, da. I probably the taste on the Castle Mouse current output. On the fourth of April Fourth interview given, and CMBD's uh, David Farber following the company's uh, victory in denying investors Nelson Peltz and former Disney uh, CFO J uh, Jay Rasulu um, uh, seats on the but yeah this is a disaster. And then they announced the female Silver Surfer. I mean fuck me, right? Uh, following discussion, Disney's financial failure future. Both I think we say the same thing. Their plans for ESPN and the recent selling, uh, uh, certainly with the state of Florida, regarding the company's ability to govern its own district in uh, in which Walt Disney World theme park is located. I could eventually ask Faber uh, uh, for I, I will eventually ask my father insight into how uh, he weathered the very public hostilities that was levelled at him, particularly from uh, Tesla CEO uh, Elon Musk in recent years. Oh, really? He the. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, uh, I just ignore it, he says. Yeah, there's no uh, relevance to the Walt Disney Company or something. I really hope he would have taken him down. Ah, oh. Further pressed by fa uh, favorite Pe People have been coming after me for years and years, and it's just I don't get distracted by those things. Yeah, you're too busy focusing on everything being fucking woke. I mean, look, oh, what? You're trying to tell me this isn't an agenda-driven shit? Ahsoka, right? Yeah, fuck me. Uh, so, uh, favorite, uh, as a source of the anti woke campaign, people are gonna, okay, fine. Uh, uh, but the woke thing has had more of an impact. I mean, you've, you've said, you said to me that you would love to see just, uh, you would love to just, what? I mean, you said to me you would love, uh, you would love to be just out of the culture war. Really? Then why are you screaming in the gut? Where this is out of the coach war, is it? This is the coach war, and you're the enemy. Oh, I mean, I understand. I've been saying, I say, I don't do any of this stuff, but we can see you doing it. Uh, I feel, uh, uh, do you feel like you're succeeding in that? I declared. Well, yes. I mean, I think the noise has sort of been quietened down. Yeah, you won. The, yeah, you won. Okay, and. Everything you do is shit, right? It's not making it better. Uh, I've been preaching for this a long time at the company, but uh, before I left and since I came back, that the number one goal was to entertain, right? Entertain and, and, and you know, uplift communities. Uh, how about that? Uh, but I think the term woke is thrown around rather liberally. Okay, so here, it's a 
Uh, Tim Paul's definition, it's a uh, minus adherence to social media algorithms idea of what, of what is moral. My definition in terms of media is the uncapable platforming of uh, ideology and messaging in, uh, in said media, normally an, an existent, uh, media, uh, me uh, existent media which has a strong uh, uh, fan base, right? Uh, Black Little Mermaid is exactly that, right? It's exactly that. Uh, so, uh, Robert Levy, no, uh, no pun intended in that. I regard that. I think a lot of people don't even understand what the term means. Well, I just defined it two very strong ways. Uh, the bottom line is that infusing messaging as any sort of number one priority. In it. Okay, so it's your number two priority. Uh, I mean, like, such transparent bullshit. Uh, um, it's a, still, you know, a priority, right? They need to be entertaining. And look, with Disney, uh, we can have a positive impact on the world, uh, whether it is, you know, foistering acceptance or understanding of, you know, people of a different type. You're not doing that. You're an you're, you're insanely privileged woke cunt. Like you're not you're not foistering understanding. You're causing division by removing culture that we could all join together and love, regardless of our skin color. Black people, generally speaking, were very offended at your Black Little Mermaid. Right, right. It's uh, um, it's bad. Right, it's bad. Uh, so you, you're not you're not trying to be entertaining. Whether well, Disney Company can have a positive impact on whether, uh, you know, by blah, 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 blah. But generally speaking, we need to be entertainment and entertainment first company. Uh, and I've worked really hard for that. Well, you failed horribly. Right. And that's why all your projects fail horribly. Right. Oh, stuff it with the government. Fuck off. No. Please don't make me. Uh, taking out the, the final sentence, uh, Father, the, uh, Father Ben and Clyde. In what way? What do you mean when you say that? Uh, God, I forgot about this. The uh, what's the name? Secret Invasion. God, that was boring shit as well. Uh, engaging with our executives, engaging with our creative community. We know returning to our roots. Uh, you know, making sure that everyone aligned on what our purpose. Is. So you're saying everything's got to be woke. Uh you know, and understanding that. Look, we've been trying to reach a, ver a, a very, very dense audience, uh, a very, very diverse audience. I mean, a teeny tiny one. Uh, uh, and on the other hand, to do that, uh, to do that, you have uh, w uh, what you, the stories you have to tell reflect the audience that you're trying to reach. It doesn't reflect America, right? That's the thing. What was the tragedy of, of Hank Azera uh, refusing to uh, something playing Apu, right? Because he said it was a white man making fun of a brown man, and he's a moron. It was an American making fun of an American, right? You'll find black people, white people, every type of person like the MCU phase one because they were generally enjoyable movies, right? Everybody liked Black Panther because that was a good movie, right? right? But the, it, like, it, it's uh, uh, the movies you make a shit. I'm sorry, they... they, they the, the people making it have replaced diversity with with story, right? Uh, uh, it, 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 they're awful, right? Um, for, so this what you're saying right now is wrong, right? You, yeah, no, you're you're absolutely wrong. But that one because it's so diverse is really uh, is really first and foremost. They want to be entertained, and sometimes they can be turned off by certain things. Well, like calling them Latinx. And we just have to be more sensitive and interesting to a broad audience. Yeah, maybe stop saying, oh, my God, there are brown people in the world. Help me. Oh, brown people make me scared. Here, I'll put a brown person in front of me. Maybe that'll make everything better. It's not easy, he concluded. Well, uh, I can see that by your complete failure, right? Your complete relentless failure. Oh, fuck me. What more? What an absolute cock womble. Oh, my name's Vila Beck and the rabbi from another planet. Please like, share, and subscribe. And ring that little bell. Ring the little bell so you're notified when new videos drop. Yeah!